Hi, and you're back at New Music Alliance Radio Hour, and I'm Mark Sherry, here with Mark Ramon. And you just heard Let Me Go by Sonia Kitchell, before that Universal Soldier by Buffy St. Marie, and starting out we had American Elm doing A Long Road to Be Free. So, song we just heard, Let Me Go. Um, you've probably heard that song before, no matter who you are out there, because that was a big <laughs> hit song. Yeah. Um, she had a big, big hit with that back in 2006. And Sonia is uh, a native out of uh, Western Mass in the Northampton area. What a f- great tune. And just funky, folksy, folksy, bluesy kind of tune. Just, Just a great tune. Such a feel-good tune. I just love listening to her voice. Oh yeah, so expressive and you know pleasing. What a tune! <laughs> and before that, we had a an amazing tune um, by um, a classic singer-songwriter, one of you know folk music's um, veritable icons, Buffy Saint Marie, doing Universal Soldier, which is the ultimate anti-war song um, back from the uh, mid-60s, 1964. Um, Buffy St. Marie actually attended UMass Amherst um, and wrote this song just either, you know, as she was leaving or shortly afterwards. And um, it became, you know, a, a huge, huge classic covered by all kinds of different people. That seems to be the time to write a protest song is when you're you're in college. <laughs> yeah, well, those were the those were the days, and this song has just an amazing, you know, kind of message. You know, just about all soldiers think you know that they'll put an end to war by you know fighting and killing for their country, um, but it never works. It never ends. It just continues. Yeah, we need a new solution. And I don't think that's changed at all since 1964, unfortunately. No, unfortunately. And this song, she's got, you know, just simple guitar and her voice, which is kind of a strident kind of arresting voice. I think it also is is really cool. She's trying, I think, to be respectful of the fact that soldiers are trained to help protect us, even if they're sent out at times when they don't need to be. Yeah, they think they're, they, you know, soldiers are going out there to fight for us, thinking that they're doing the right thing. Right. Exactly. And, uh, yep. But what she's saying is that, you know, that's not the way to end war. It's just not going to work. Yeah. And we started out with um, a song by um, American Elm out of Chester, Connecticut, uh, A Long Road to Be Free. I guess that's a, another kind of freedom kind of uh, message. Um, this is more about personal freedom, though. This this is a band that also eluded me back in the day. I don't know where I was. I must have been asleep. But, I mean, they're, they're so good. They've got the classic alt-country feel, Americana space folk, they call it. They've collaborated and performed with some greats like Roger McGuinn, Mercury Rev, Miracle Legion, Asleep at the Wheel, Rhett Miller, Mark, Mark Mulcahy, The Turtles, Nathaniel Rateliff. So this is around. a 2018 release. Mm. And yeah, it's a great tune about, you know, how, you know, you could have, um, he says, you know, it could have been kinder, more insightful. You know, I could have done lots of things. And if I did, you know, I could get to my personal redemption and freedom. Kind of. Yeah. Links with uh, Buffy St. Marie's Universal Soldier in a way, then, doesn't it? Yeah, I did think about that a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, what have we got for our last block? Oh, we've got a, a stellar blockbuster wrap up for the end of the show. Let's start it off with Karen Allison. Wrap up some of that sunshine. 